Coming to you from Studio 703. This is Bronco TV. Hey Broncos, welcome to the first episode of Bronco TV. I'm your host Fair. And I'm Blake. Hey Fair, did you sign up for any clubs at Club Rush? Actually, I'm president of a club called Crew. Oh. Let's see what our other Broncos have been up to. Hey Broncos, it's Colin. The school year is off to a quick start as students are participating in many Bronco activities. The Welcome Back Assembly truly began the year right with Mr. LeMaster's opening speech and many great performances from the RBHS dance and cheer teams. The annual Blacklight Dance was a blast as Broncos were brought together to celebrate the start of the new school year. Back to School Night was a success. Parents were happily greeted by students who got the opportunity to show off their awesome clubs and programs. They then headed into the classrooms to meet all our amazing teachers. Club Rush is thriving with a record-breaking amount of clubs. Our Broncos are showing off their pride and passions by sharing what they love with others on campus. Things are finally settling in here on campus as schedules are being finalized and students are adjusting to their new classes. 4x4 four four and scheduling is a, a very complex puzzle. It is a little bit more work for us, but I think it's better for the student. My best advice for students that want to switch classes would be to do it for the right reasons. I definitely feel counselors have the best interest at heart. They're doing a great job trying to get people into college. Yes, I think they do. They help me out. They're super nice and super easy going. And they are, they are very a helpful resource that students have. And I appreciate it. I personally think they do. My counselor is um, Mr. Hunt, and he has helped me a lot. So I personally think that they do a good job helping students. And congratulations are in order for the RBHS Choir, who won $2,500 in funding and got to perform with rock legend Foreigner. It was so much fun, just the kick of being on stage with that many people watching us and just, I mean, it was a, it was a super cool experience. Just seeing the huge amphitheater, is just, it just sets in just like, holy crap. It was absolutely thrilling to see 20,000 people give us a standing ovation. You can't replace that. It's just really incredible. I'm on cloud 54. I'm so proud of my students. I can't begin to tell you how proud of them I am. <laughs> They've worked so hard and they sang beautifully and they deserved this. Hi team! Whether it's pep rallies, tailgates, or the stable, RB Hype Team is bringing Bronco Spirit back to campus. Hype Team got started. Um, administration last year, I think, was looking for a solution to try to connect our students more and to create a little bit more spirit on campus. It's a work in progress. I feel like because we're a new group and a new team, um, the vision is there, but we're not really sure how everything's gonna play out. Um, really, we just wanna try to get more just a spirit around the whole school and the whole atmosphere is kind of the idea behind it. Hype team is attempting to win Battle of the Fans, so all Broncos, be there or be square. Hi guys, I'm Leslie and this is your ASB Update. As you all hopefully know, this week is homecoming week. I'm so excited to see you guys all in your disco outfits. Here are the rest of this week's spirit days. Tomorrow is country day. Come out and wear your best cowboy and cowgirl outfit. Then Wednesday is hip hop day. Be sure to be dressed in all your gangster gear. And Thursday is rock and roll day. I better be seeing all of you guys wearing your rad shirts. And Friday, of course, is Bronco Blue! Be sure to be wearing your Bronco Blue. Also, some other reminders, this week is float building, and this Saturday will be our school dance. Be sure to get your tickets, Broncos. Have a great week. What are you doing? I'm practicing for my tennis match today. Um, Blake, it's definitely girls season. Oh.
From touchdowns to goals to sets, our Bronco athletes are off and running this season, leading into victory. Whether it's continuing a mission from last year or strengthening their teams, they're taking the challenges on head first. Girls Tennis is making their goals obvious and working hard to improve their record on last year. This year we want to keep building on what we did last year and continuing to accomplish big things. We won a league title last year. Hopefully this year we can win league again and get to the finals of CIF. It's like a big family. They're all sisters. They plan things together. They do things together. They play tennis on the weekends together. So it's great because they all have their back. Make sure to go out and support all your Bronco athletes this season. Hey, so far we've had a lot of great things from the beginning of the school year. Yeah, and you might have heard a lot about the RB experience. Uh, I don't know, man. I didn't know it existed. Um, oh, oh, <laughs> um, oh God, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, but hey, Mom. We got great sports, great team, great spirit, you know, we get out here, we have fun with things we do. There's a great support community, the parents here are very helpful. Getting out there and like getting out of your comfort zone. The RV has a lot of opportunities. People who are there to support you. Being the best person you could be. No other school I've seen has like this many things going on. Getting to know your peers. Basically being together. Close-knit community environment. Just having fun as a student. Right now I'm loving it. It's this campus, the people here. And everyone's really welcoming. A mix of different cultures. RV experience is life, dude. Uh, the different activities that they're involved in, whether it has to do with sports or extracurriculars, the performing arts, I mean all the different things that students do here. To me, I think students need to be not only uh, outstanding citizens in our world, but also just kind of forward thinking and, and how they can make it a better place. That's the best part of being at Arby. As the new year starts, Arby High introduces in new faces and faculty to the campus. RB is a positive and inviting campus which greets new staff members with open arms. I really enjoy working here. Everyone in the, in the counseling office has been really nice to me. Everyone in the whole office has been really nice. All the kids are great. It's been a big transition. So with, with how open and uh, helping everyone has been towards me, it's made that transition a little bit easier. I really like working with the staff, the teachers, the students I've interacted with have also been really awesome. Um, everybody seems pretty motivated and interested and engaged. Our Broncos work hard to ensure that both students and staff feel included and proud to be a part of our community. Uh, people reached out right away, you know, introduced themselves and asked me if I needed anything and, you know, so that, that always helps quite a bit. Everybody is really friendly with each other and the whole school culture and community has been great. So that's it for the first episode of Bronco TV. Make sure you check us out on YouTube and, and subscribe. subscribe.